Hello friends, welcome to Reena's YouTube channel. Today we are going to discuss about 5 interesting math riddles. Hope you will enjoy the video and find it helpful. Now let's begin with the video. Now let's begin with the first question. The first question is what is 5 plus 5 multiplied by 5 minus 5 plus 5. So you will have 30 seconds to answer and the timer starts now. Fifteen seconds to go. And the answer is twenty. So let me explain you how the answer is twenty on the whiteboard. So here I am in the whiteboard. So according to the rule of Mac, we must perform multiplication first then we need to move to addition and finally perform the arithmetic of subtraction so now let's discuss the topic so according to max as i said earlier we must multiply these numbers so 5 multiplied by 5 equals 25 and then let's move to addition so we'll just check the first number the plus 5 so I have marked it in red now. So 25 plus 5. Next let's take minus 5 plus 5. Which is same as 10. Minus 10. So we are going to take it as minus 10. And 30 minus 10 gives us 20. Okay. Now let's go back to the answer board. And now let's check it. Okay now let's move on to the next riddle. Now the second question is a very mind blowing riddle. You must have a very high thinking skill for this. And the question is what is half of 4 plus 4? You have exactly 30 seconds to answer and the timer starts now. Fifteen seconds to go. Okay. Now the answer is six. Let me explain you how it is possible to have an answer like six. So if you think in a manner, you may get four as the answer, which is same as four plus four which is 8 and half of 8 gives us 4 back but that's not the answer here we are asking half of 4 so half of 4 is 2 and 2 plus 4 gives us 6 so this is how we give us 6 so hope you got it and it's time for the next one so the explanation is half of 4 equals 2 and 2 plus 4 equals 6 the third question is a really logical one. It requires deep arithmetic thinking capacity. So here it is. Can you make 1000 by using 8 exactly 8 times? And remember, you can only use addition here. So the timer starts now. Fifteen seconds to go. And the answer is yes, of course we can. So let me show you how. So first, let me go into the whiteboard. So the first digit is going to be triple eight or eight hundred and eighty eight. So next, we are going to add 88 to it. Then, we are going to remain the three other 8's. That is 8, 8 and 8 into singular ones so that we get a sum of 1000. So let us add it now. So let me scroll a bit. And now, 
8 plus 8 equals 16 16 plus 8 equals 24 and 24 plus 8 32 and we have 44 carry forward and again we have 12 20 and again 2 as a carry forward so now we have 10 and that's a thousand so see we got the correct answer as thousand now let's go back and see the correct explanation so explanation is 888 plus 88 plus 8 plus 8 plus 8 equals 1000. Now it's time for the next rule and that's a very difficult one. So let's see if you can get it. This one as said earlier is an incredible question with a very simple logic. You must be very familiar in fractions and have the capability of using the right logic. So the question is what is 30 divided by 1 by 2 and plus 10? You will have 30 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Time is up and the answer is 70. So if you think the answer is 35, then you are absolutely wrong. So let me explain. So 30 divided by 1 half is exactly the same as 30 multiplied by 2 by 1. So if you remember, in the rule of fractions, we divide the number with the inverted fraction and multiply it. So if you want to do that, it's 30 into 2 which gives us 60. 60 by 1 is same as 60. So 60 plus 10 gives us 70. Hope you got this riddle. And now it's time for the next one. Now let's see the proper definition. The proper definition is the number must be multiplied by an inverted fraction. That is 30 divided by 1 half gives us 30 multiplied by 2 by 1 which gives us 60 plus 10 which is 70.